In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Honoring the Blessed Mother. Very beautiful practice that we could try to incorporate in our lives to sanctify the course of the day is to pray to the Blessed Virgin Mary. You know, I've heard that in the Philippines, they, at 12 noon, in malls, in public places, even on the radio, they stop everything. And the reason is to honor Mary. Mary, the Mother of God. And how is this done? By the praying of the Angelus. The Pope, when he's in Rome, on Sunday at 12 noon, he will give a short talk and then he prays the Angelus publicly in the Piazza of San, of San Pedro, giving us public witness of the importance of honoring Mary. So get in the habit of praying the Angelus. You can even, even pray the Angelus whenever you want, but it wouldn't be a bad idea to pray the Angelus three times a day. Nine o'clock, 12 noon, and 6 p.m. Why these three separate hours? Because at nine o'clock in the morning, we can pray to sanctify the morning hours through Mary. 12 noon to sanctify the afternoon through Mary. And 6 p.m. to sanctify the evening hours through Mary. The Angelus is a beautiful prayer that incorporates within it three Hail Marys and three short biblical expressions and they exemplify those the two pillars of our Catholic faith. The incarnation of the Son of God through Mary. We end by praying this. We pray that through his passion and death, we might be brought, brought to the glory of the resurrection. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. So the second part calls to mind the mystery of our redemption. The Paschal Mystery, that Christ suffered, died, but also he rose from the dead. So maybe starting today, pray the Angelus. At least once a day, but even if you can, pray the Angelus at 9 o'clock in the morning to sanctify your morning through Mary. At midday, to sanctify the afternoon through Mary. And 6 p.m., to sanctify the evening through Mary. Amen.